everyone, it's Matt from Drawing Tutorials Hall. I can't even say it. <laughs> hey everyone, it's Matt from DrawingTutorialsOnline.com. I can't say the word tutorials today, so I think I did an okay job. We have a treat for you guys. We've got Alex, and Alex is back with two really special sketchbooks. And uh, yeah, I go, go for it, Alex. Go for it. So basically, um, there's so much content within these sketchbooks that uh, I just can't believe how, how much he, he's got in here. Um, Alex, why don't you center that like on, sure. on those, yeah, that would be better. And really impressive amount of drawings hidden within the pages of these sketchbooks. I mean, even like the little storyboarding just the, it's just so, like, there's stuff everywhere. It, it's just crazy. I don't even know where to look first. So much going on. <laughs> and if you guys remember Alex's uh, first sketchbook video, uh, the title of it was Pink Sets Me Free. This so, one doesn't really have that much pink, actually. Actually, this is like my navy sketchbook. Na na <laughs> navy blue, like like deep blue. I don't know why. Yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna call this thing uh, Battlesh Battleship Galactica. <laughs> <laughs> navy gray Battleship Galactica. This is gonna be the name of this sketchbook. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I mean, trying to go at like an even canvas here because. When I, when I tell you that this sketchbook is filled front to back, you've got to really believe me that it's filled front to back. How long did this sketchbook take you? Uh, I don't know. I kind of started, I like started as soon as I got back from spring break and I was really rusty. And then Spencer just got done with his and everybody loved it. Everybody loves Spencer, so I'm trying to beat him now. <laughs> You're trying to uh, <laughs> kick Spencer's butt? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's, this is me trying. That's a lofty goal. That's good. That's good. So competition is a very good thing. Nice. Yeah, it's good to kind of get together with a um, with some friends and just kind of push yourselves and and see what you can do with your sketchbooks. And then you know the the big thing is sharing sketchbooks and and looking at each other's work. And it just you know this class was really special. This Friday class. This year because um, everyone fed off of each other and everyone grew together so it was just really fantastic to see and a little bit of each person's style rubbed off onto other people which is just fantastic. Uh, yeah well this is like I guess as you guys knew for my go-to guy. Um, it's a character I'm working on now for a film that I titled uh, Skeleton Blood. Okay. Um, and his name is Kookaburra now, like the Australian bird. Cool. Yeah. So. Very nice. And this is just like rough storyboard, so it actually goes like this. <laughs> I've been trying to draw in pen lately too, because I heard that it helps you draw in pencil if you draw in pen for a while, because then you're like more sure of your line and all. So I was trying to do that. Sweet. Recently also. Nice. A little bit of homework mixed in there. Well, this is my friend's page. Holly. Lots of color. Very cool. It's always nice to have your friend drawing your sketchbook. Something different. Crazy page right there. So much detail. Look at that. Can't even really capture it on this phone but it looks amazing. Yeah, look at the detail in those. Lot to look at, huh? Crazy. Storyboarding. It's just the weird cutesy thing I was telling you about. Stupid. Wow. Wow. Blue pencil? 
Yeah. So blue color it's, it's is navy, blue. indigo blue. Yeah. Yeah, I like that color too. It's really a great color. I, I would be using the pink more in this, but the paper, like, it doesn't pick up color as well unless you're really, like, going at it. Mm. For some reason, I don't know, I guess it's not enough tooth or whatever. It's too smooth. But I found that the, the indigo works pretty well with smooth paper, so I've been using that more. For this nice. Thing. Cool. The tree thing in class. And yeah, we were. T I was teaching the students how to draw trees, and uh, then we went out to the park and, and drew trees. It was a really fun day. So this sketchbook is pretty new. You did a lot in a short period of time. Seriously. Wow. Now that one is interesting to say the least. Gosh. A little bit of life drawing class. Perspective outside on a field trip. Yeah, drawing trees once again. Yeah. It looks more like something underwater, so I drew like these like underwater people in it. Nice. <laughs> wicked, wicked, wicked. Yeah, I think one of the characters, maybe it was in your sketchbook, I, I had a love affair, a visual love affair with mm -hmm. one of your characters. So pretty. Yeah, I actually, like, back in the day, I drew a lot of, like, robots and, and uh, mechanical stuff. But uh, my teacher discouraged me a lot with it and said that's like all I drew, so I stopped after coming here. And I, I noticed that a lot of kids here didn't draw mechanical things, so yeah. I, I like wanted to do it in this sketch. Yeah, I mean, I, I have, keep, keep going, keep going. I have, um, you know, some sympathy. I, there's a lot of students that draw the same thing. I'm like, just try a little variety. But I would never discourage um, a student from drawing something that they really love. Uh, you know, I would caution them against going through four years of college and drawing the same thing for all four years, and I've seen that happen. Uh, so variety is, is a good thing, but man, yeah, you're really good at both mechanical and organic. I mean, it's organic like shapes. <laughs> nice. It's a masterpiece. <laughs> yeah. Very cool. Ken's page? Yeah. Just stuff at the park and stuff. Okay. Nice. Dilworth came and uh, lectured our class for a day, like uh, the creator of Courage, the kind mm. dog and all. It's pretty interesting. We like bonded. I gave him a hug. <laughs> 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 yeah, I really dig his like monsters and stuff. Oh yeah, that's a uh, like mammoth skull at uh, well. Museum of Natural History. God. Now this is a man on a mission. This sketchbook is a man on a mission. I, I don't think that the sketchbook video should be titled Battleship Gray. I think it should be titled Man on a Mission <laughs> because this is just insanity. What do you think, Greg? Man on a Mission? All right. And then somehow, some way, your video, Greg, we got to incorporate um, Subway Black Book. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, again, you know, it's one thing to, to watch the video on this little iPhone. It's another thing to hold a sketchbook in your hand. And 
I, I have to admit, when you hold a sketchbook in your hand, it could get like a little overwhelming. Like you really don't know what to look at first. There's just so much going on. Greg did that for me. Greg did that? Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. Do you want to see the other Yeah, thing? yeah. Let's see. Um, let's see how much. I don't know how much video space I'm going to have, but let's just go for it. Let's go a little faster with this one. This one is what we would call a big mama jamma. Okay, or Mamma Jamma if you're from down south. Oh, wait. You know, I say go faster, but look at this. So you can see the freedom that Alex has drawn bigger. Just look at that. Nice and free and flowing. Uh, the other one was free flowing. This one is beyond free flowy. I'll tell you, it's so much easier to do the sketchbook video when somebody else flips the page. Yeah, I would encourage you to do more of that mechanical stuff. I mean, it's just phenomenal when you combine the mechanical with the organic. Very nice. Look at this. Yeah, this was over a winter break, I think, actually. And I didn't have any color race with me. So I your know. pencil was smudged. Yeah, and I was like, graphite. Uh -oh. <laughs> and then it was just like, bleh. <laughs> oh. So like the whole, almost the whole first half of this sketchbook is uh, smudging yeah. from walking with it in the city. Gosh, God. So yeah. Oh, is this Spencer drew that? Yeah. It's one it's supposed from to be Spencer. like him, like killing me or something. That's Spencer killing Alex. Yeah, I'm killing him with my work. <laughs> Unbelievable. I mean, if you're into drawing, like I am, this is Christmas. <laughs> Some stuff in class with the model. Gestural work, I believe. Yeah, that was like the continuation of that last story. It's like some composition. Wow. Hold on. This is nuts. I know. Have you heard me say that once or twice before in a video? Now you guys got to stay tuned for the end of this video because I'm going to send you a link um, or tell you where to go to find a link to Alex's Tumblr and uh, that would be really great if you guys can go follow Alex on Tumblr. Go ahead. Yeah, again, like all this graphite stuff smudged. I never, I haven't looked in this in a while, so it's more than even the last time I looked in it. Hmm. Which is kind of annoying. Chrisanne and Diana. Come on, drawing here. I fell asleep in class and they like took over. <laughs> you fell asleep in <laughs> class and then they started drawing in your sketchbook. Classic. Beautiful. Thank you. So, do you have some of this posted on your Tumblr? Oh uh, yeah, a lot of it is actually. Not all of it, definitely not all of it, but um, a lot of it is. Okay. Also, my uh, Tumblr is pronounced uh, Dolzia, if uh, you're interested. Because like, it's, it's spelled kind of weird, so a lot of people have difficulty trying to pronounce it. Okay. So, yeah. Love that. Very cool. Red. Oh wow, I was looking at two heads on that page. That was that was funky. 
Yeah, that was a collaboration between me and Palmini, actually. So, I think this was like the leap to the back, actually. Okay. Sweet. So you guys inspired to draw yet? I know I am. This is craziness. Back to the pink. Hmm. All right, well, we're coming down to the end of my iPhone storage. Hold on, hold on. Okay, keep going, keep going. And uh, Alex, I really want to thank you uh, for sharing all of these beautiful drawings. I mean, it's insane. I wish we can, you know, film this for an hour, uh, but I've got to go do my grades. And uh, yes clean out my lockers and Alex has got to go continue to impress the world with his wonderful artwork that is insane probably going to just go sleep and eat you're going to go sleep and eat? <laughs> okay alright well I'm going to sleep and eat after my grades I, I just this is crazy it just keeps it's the never end this is no doubt about it. man on a mission man on a mission sketchbook man on a mission all right alex thank you no problem. awesome 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 alex is going to continue to draw all summer so he doesn't lose his touch thank you guys for watching Click on my blog for the link. If I look like I'm gonna fall over, it's because I'm getting dizzy. I'm bending over for about 15 minutes filming this sketchbook. Be good. <laughs>